My goal has always been to promote the cause of liberty and to obey the Constitution. And I don't like the use of force. I like volunteerism. That's what a free society is supposed to be all about. When Congress does get around to passing laws, they're dictatorial too. Everybody's telling the people what to do. My name is Allie Haven. I wanted to explain why Ron Paul is someone that voluntarists and anarcho-capitalists and people who are anti-state can still like Ron Paul and still support him. What Ron Paul has effectively done, he's used the one thing that the state is really great at, which is promoting itself. It's pretty much the only thing the state's good at. And he's used that against them. And he's entered the political arena as someone who supports non-aggression, in a sense, hijacking that and using the self-promotion of the state to try to influence people and persuade people towards liberty. And I agree, we are still in danger, but most of the danger comes by our lack of wisdom on how we run our foreign policy. I am convinced that needless and unnecessary wars are a great detriment. They undermine our prosperity and our liberties. They add to our deficits and they consume our welfare. And I was your son. I think everyone's really just trying to seek more liberty for themselves. What Ron Paul is doing is offering the sound bites and offering the sort of rational thinking that allows people to wake up, snap out of it. A lot of people that I know that are voluntaries came through Ron Paul to get where they are today in their mindset. Just to see someone reach so many people on television, in debates, to see someone out there saying these things is amazing. If you notice the more popularity he gains, the more other people sort of take on these ideas, even if they're just pandering, at least they're sort of spreading this idea that it's better to be free. We should actually legalize alternative health care, allow people to have practice what they want. I, I think my ideas are young and they're very appealing. So far, the Ron Paul campaign obviously has been making big inroads into the American people, spreading the ideas of liberty in a way that I'd have never seen in my lifetime. We all use the word states' rights, but in a way, states don't have rights. Uh, only individuals have rights. All the support for Ron Paul going on right now just means more anarchists or voluntarists later. These ideas that have freed our minds, and I know they've helped me a lot. And I couldn't have done it if it weren't for someone like Ron Paul. I, I honestly think it would have taken me a lot longer. And I don't know that I'd be in New Hampshire right now fighting for liberty if it wasn't for Ron Paul. So thank you, Ron Paul. There is no authority in the Constitution authorizing a central bank, which means there should be no Federal Reserve System. It's really exciting to watch Ron Paul change hearts and minds out there. So